Characteristics of Science 1. Empirical Evidence Science relies on empirical evidence, which is derived from observations and experiments. This evidence is critical for developing theories and models that explain natural phenomena. 2. Repeatability and Reproducibility Scientific findings must be repeatable and reproducible by other researchers. This ensures that results are consistent and not due to chance or experimental error. 3. Predictability Science aims to make predictions about future events or phenomena based on established theories and models. These predictions can be tested and validated through experimentation. 4. Falsifiability Scientific hypotheses and theories must be falsifiable, meaning they can be proven wrong through evidence. This allows for the refinement and improvement of scientific knowledge. 5. Objectivity Science strives for objectivity, minimizing personal biases and subjective influences. This is achieved through peer review, standardized methods, and transparent reporting of results. 6. Systematic Approach Scientific research follows a systematic approach, often using the scientific method. This involves making observations, forming a hypothesis, conducting experiments, analyzing data, and drawing conclusions. 7. Theoretical Frameworks Science builds on theoretical frameworks that provide explanations for observations. These frameworks are continually tested and revised based on new evidence. 8. Ethical Considerations Scientific research adheres to ethical guidelines to ensure the integrity of the research process and the welfare of research subjects, whether human or animal. 9. Technological Advancements Science drives technological advancements, and in turn, technology enhances scientific research by providing new tools and methods for investigation. 10. Interdisciplinary Nature Modern science is increasingly interdisciplinary, integrating knowledge and methods from various fields to address complex questions and problems. Biblical understanding of science. 1. Creation and order. The Bible portrays the natural world as a creation of God, characterized by order and purpose. This view supports the idea that studying the natural world is a way to understand God's creation. 2. Dominion and stewardship. Biblical texts often emphasize humanity's role in having dominion over the earth and being stewards of creation. This stewardship implies a responsibility to study, understand, and care for the natural world. 3. Knowledge and Wisdom The Bible values knowledge and wisdom, encouraging the pursuit of understanding. Proverbs and other wisdom literature emphasize the importance of seeking knowledge and understanding God's creation. 4. Faith and Reason Biblical understanding does not see faith and reason as mutually exclusive. Instead, it views reason and scientific inquiry as complementary to faith, with both contributing to a fuller understanding of truth. 5. Revelation and Observation The Bible is seen as a source of divine revelation, providing truths that may not be accessible through empirical observation alone. However, observation of the natural world is also valued as a means of learning about God's creation. 6. Purpose and Meaning From a biblical perspective, the study of science is not only about understanding how the natural world works, but also about understanding the purpose and meaning behind it. This perspective adds a dimension of purpose to scientific inquiry. 7. Ethical and Moral Dimensions Biblical understanding of science includes ethical and moral dimensions guided by principles such as the sanctity of life, justice, and care for creation. These principles influence how scientific research is conducted and applied. 8. Historical Context The Bible provides historical context for understanding the development of human knowledge and civilization, including early forms of scientific inquiry and technological advancement. 9. Integration of Knowledge Biblical understanding supports the integration of scientific knowledge with theological and philosophical insights. This holistic approach seeks to harmonize scientific findings with spiritual beliefs. 10. Limitations of Human Knowledge The Bible acknowledges the limitations of human knowledge and the mysteries of God's creation. 
This humility encourages a respectful and open-minded approach to scientific inquiry, recognizing that not all questions may have immediate or complete answers. Integrating science and biblical understanding. One, complementarity. Science and biblical understanding can be seen as complementary rather than contradictory. Science explains the mechanisms of the natural world, while the Bible provides insights into the purpose and meaning behind it. Two, dialogue and engagement. Engaging in dialogue between science and biblical understanding can lead to a more comprehensive view of reality. This dialogue can address questions that lie at the intersection of empirical evidence and spiritual insight. Three, educational approaches. Now, integrating science and biblical understanding in education can provide a balanced approach, teaching students to appreciate both the empirical rigor of science and the spiritual insights of the Bible. Four, ethical frameworks. Biblical principles can inform ethical frameworks for scientific research, ensuring that scientific advancements respect human dignity and the integrity of creation. Five, addressing contemporary issues. Integrating science and biblical understanding can provide valuable perspectives on contemporary issues, such as environmental stewardship, bioethics, and the implications of technological advancements. Conclusion. The characteristics of science and the biblical understanding of science each offer unique contributions to our understanding of the natural world. Science provides a systematic and empirical approach to discovering how the world works while biblical understanding adds a dimension of purpose, meaning, and ethical considerations. Together, they can offer a richer, more nuanced perspective on the complexities of the natural world and our place within it. Engaging in constructive dialogue between these perspectives can lead to a more holistic understanding and a more ethical approach to scientific inquiry.